Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel once again. We are back in Oakland Zoo. I do hope you're well. Um, thanks for joining me. We are going to be working on our roof a little bit, I think, today. Um, so, we've uh, we've got a bit of feedback from people. Um, so, I'm recording this episode on, what is it today? Tuesday today. So, I've already got a few episodes in the bank and they will be going out over the next few days. So, your feedback from yesterday's episode to so Monday's episode, I'm, I'm listening to and acting on it now. But this episode isn't going to be going out until, I think, Saturday possibly. So, it, it's going to look over the, the next couple of days or the last couple of days once you hear this. Like, I've been ignoring your feedback. I promise I haven't and I do really appreciate it. So, one of the biggest things that a few people mentioned was that I didn't put a railing on, on the top of the mesh on this bridge here. And you're absolutely right, uh, it does need it because the mesh doesn't quite look right, does it, at the top there. So, I, that's what I'm going to do first. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do, but I'm going to do something. I did wonder whether something like this potentially could fit in or not. Uh, problem is it's got yeah it's got the bars all the way down. And what I was thinking is whether I could use that as the top bar um, or not. Do you know what? I don't mind that actually. It, it could look good. Let's have a look. The issue is going to be this bottom bit but I can always play around with that and do something different. I quite like that look actually. I think it works well with the mesh looking like it's sort of integrated a bit more with um uh yeah hang on uh yeah looking like the you know the mesh is integrated a bit more with um what am i trying to say with the metal beams of this bit is what i'm trying to say but i'm just not saying it very well right hang on let me come over to this end first right hang on, how does that go that goes like that just trying to get it to look as good as it can yeah, so that. Uh, you see, so there, that one does sort of disappear into there. I can always move the wooden posts a bit, can't I? You know, just add in the odd extra post. Actually, yeah, because those those fit quite nicely like that. So, I, I guess. Oh, hang on, I'm clicking on the wrong thing now. I suppose I could do that I would also then need to move that and just that one a tiny bit as well great that does look pretty good actually I like that and then here it's a bit tricky because ideally I would want that like that um, I mean, I could just, I could do it sort of like that, and then if I'm, yeah, I can move that across to there, kind of fills the gap in, doesn't it? I mean, it means, we, you you know, you've got, you've got some extra wood, but that's fine, I don't mind that. It's not, uh, hang on. How many pieces has this got? One, two, three, four, and then there. One, two, three, four, and then there. I think I need. I need to. I need to do this. I think to to make it look a bit more balanced. And then, yeah, if I get if I can get the wood balanced, then I may just have to then fiddle around with these a bit um, yeah that, I think that's gonna work and then I can get that one like that okay how do we look that is looking good yeah that looks a lot more um, sturdy now doesn't it as well okay that's great um, I'll tell you what I'll do <clears throat> So I, I need to have something on the top of this. It's I can't use the same thing. Um, or oh, can I? No, I can't. <laughs> it's the answer. Oh, no, I don't think it's going to work, is it? Because if I do... 
Do you know what? I I don't dislike that. Because you wouldn't want people potentially being able to jump over. So I don't mind that, actually. Tell you what, if I if I bring that just across, I just want this bit to look good here. So that's gonna have to come right over to there. Okay, that's fine. I'll tell you what I can do. Oh good, yes, because there is two of them. So I can move that up like that. I think this has got the same, hasn't it? Yeah, this has got two. So I'll move that up as well. And then can I move that? Oh, hang on. Oh, it's not going to let me. No, it's not going to let me do them like that. Okay, that's fine. Let's move them up, get them to the right height. And let's see about moving them in a bit. And that's fine. I can. I can move the mesh as well, just a little bit. If I move that in, I can line it up there as well, so that matches. Great. I'm then going to need to copy that upwards. Again, we've got to try and... Uh, hang on. Oh, let's do... Let's do that, and then let's just move this one up a tiny bit to match it like so this bit let's move this one up first like that let's just match this up the best I can great and then move this down as well onto the bottom oh yes that's much nicer isn't it that looks a lot safer Right, I'll do the same at this end as well. Do you know what, while people aren't there, I'm just gonna pause the game just so I can do this without people getting in the way. Uh, see now this end looks a bit different, doesn't it? Because this wood is in a slightly different place. It's typical, isn't it? I can't get it at both ends looking good at the same time. It's fine, uh, let's do that. Let's just see what's yeah, that's that's gonna have to be about there to cover that up. I can oh yes, there we go. I can move that across. Okay, good. Right, so then I need to move those two up to there. No, wrong piece. Let me come around this way. I'm sure there's another one. Yes, there is. There we go. Let's get those moved up as well. Like so, okay, we're nearly there. And then what I'm gonna do is just duplicate this whole thing over to the other side. Okay, so let's move that up like that and copy it down. Ah, hang on, I can't move it quite that far. I've got to, I'm gonna to have to line it up, up here, aren't I, like that. Uh, luckily this one I can do independently from it, which is helpful. So I'll do it up to there first. Then I will drop it down. And there we go. What do we think? Well, I hope you like it because I'm not doing it again. <laughs> right, and then what I'm going to do is just come over this side. Oh no, <laughs> I forgot about that. Uh, no, that's fine, I can, yes, good, there we go. Phew, I can do it like that. Yeah, so if I get rid of that, and then again, if I highlight the whole thing, and then deselect that lot, and then I can copy this one, hopefully, over to here. I want it to look roughly the same. I think it just needs to come over a bit more. I just want the gap there to look about the same on each side. So it needs to come over even more. Oh yeah, that looks about right. Let's just scan along, make sure nothing else is going wrong. 
No, that's looking good. Right, let's click that into place. Boom, there we go. So we have our handrails. And yeah, I think that makes the whole thing look a lot safer now, doesn't it? People aren't gonna be able to fall out and into the water or whatever. Brilliant, okay, let's, uh, let's start the game going again. Cool, there we go. So thanks for that, that was a good suggestion. So what I'm thinking, the, the main thing I still need to do obviously is the roof, and the other thing is the entrance and where the, the shops are, but I, I still haven't had inspiration for this, and I kind of feel like I need to get the roof in place first. So, let's have a think. Let's get the backstage in first, I think, the backstage roof. Um, so this I want to do, I know exactly which one I want. I want this green one. Because most of this you're not really going to see, I hope. That's the plan anyway. Uh, let's get the corners on first. Uh, I need to change the grid size. Uh, yeah, see this is where it starts getting tricky because you're going to end up with overlapping bits like that. But I don't mind that, that's fine. I can can solve these problems as I go along. Uh, let's think, how do I want this to look? Let's just come down and see. Yeah, I mean, there might be a bit of trial and error with this. Certainly with bits like this. Uh, I'll tell you what I need to do. I, can't, I think I do need to kind of fill in the, fill it in as I go along, I think. Um, so let yeah let's just let's see what I can do yeah you see that that's already caused a bit of an issue hasn't it thing is when you've got, you've got this they don't give us thin strips for some reason it's really annoying that they don't you know for uh, like that is as narrow as it gets when well, that's clearly no good for what I have planned for this building so see, I'm going to have to move that back to there, um, which I didn't really want to have to do. But there we go. You, sometimes you just you just got to go with it. Um, so I will have this going along the back. Good. At least that bit sort of matched up. Um, see, I'm going to have to. Maybe do something like that along there. Let's. You kind of just keep filling in the gaps with this sort of roof, and eventually, you might get to a stage where it looks half decent. <laughs> I mean, you might not. You never know what can be done here. I guess. I don't know if this is going to look any good. Do you know what? I don't mind that. I think that does look all right. Because again, you're not going to see it. That's the that's the point. This is this is functional. It's not attractive. You know, from down here, you don't see that at all, which is kind of the point. Good. Okay. Well, let's keep going then. Um, so here, um, I'm going to want another corner there this is a very complicated bit here i'm probably going to do uh, that's not quite yeah let's go with that you'll see what i'm thinking about in a minute <laughs> well hopefully you do anyway okay Okay, let's get the corners in here, if I can. I don't know if these will fit perfectly or not, but let's give it a go. Okay, and then let's, uh, let's, oh no, I should probably have come across like that. Let's do that. So that, can go. I think that one needs to move to there. OK, 
okay how's that yep that's okay I think I'm gonna need one more of them like that and hang on let's uh, let's integrate like so let's get another corner in here something like that oh I've got a got a sharp piece showing there I don't need that do I okay that's gonna have to go is there not oh yeah there we go I can do that that looks good okay right so then what I'm thinking is hopefully oh no <laughs> it's too narrow okay that messed my plans up didn't it okay well I can get uh, no I can't okay hang on let's go back to these uh, no wrong piece how about this how is does this piece fit no hmm okay tricky 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 Oh, hang on, why has my grid height disappeared? That's so annoying when it does that. Okay, no, that's not going to work. Um, right, I think that piece is going to have to go let's see if I can fit uh, that's why I'm using yeah it's too too steep that's that's the piece oh oh no it's not oh what I'm sure that should line up with those uh, you know what it needs to go, yeah it goes like that doesn't it so does that mean if I do one, uh, which way around would it need to go for this one? Like that. Ah, but then you end up with a bit sticking up there, which is no good. Oh, and I've got it there. Right, is there anything I can do to hide that? Let's have a look. I'm determined I if you have to I can just add bits on like this actually do you know what that might look quite nice I can do that and then I can do the same here to cover it up here as well yeah see I like that even if I didn't need to cover bits up like that I think that actually looks pretty good right <laughs> we're, we're still going it's all good right so I think I need one of them in there like yeah that's the same as there that's good oh we haven't got too many gaps left we are definitely making some progress so I can cover that quite easily like that I can do that but then I've still got a bit of a gap here so I can do that uh, that's not the right angle for that piece Hang on, what have I got here ah oh, that's a flat piece ah okay I'll tell you what if I bring if I bring that back to there and then do it again there I can then I can copy that one round to there yes here we go wow beautiful look at that I got there in the end 
and there's even look there is what is this this is non-grid I could even do like a little oh no this is on the grid oh my word that fits perfectly I know that means I wasted the bits inside but actually look at that I like that that looks cool right I've still got to figure out all this stuff here tell you what I think I can do this bit like this potentially no hang on yes I can I can I can come all the way along like this get that right into there and then turn it round and do the same here see this is the joy of making roofs where you don't have to worry about what it looks like underneath because obviously under here it looks terrible um, but because it's backstage it doesn't matter right I need to do that and that actually if I move that across one oh no that's not enough okay and then turn it and do the same here and here have we got our roof no hang on we're nearly there we're very very close I need one of them there and one of them there excellent look at that yeah so it's a bit complicated doing that kind of stuff but the end result I think looks really cool I really like these these points actually at the end they've worked out very nicely because you will see them from the, they'll just give you that little sense of something going on over there ah yes now I was going to do this piece um, I was going to use the flat one just to cover this edge was my my plan kind of something like that and then uh, if I do add to building add to this one whether I can then do something something like that for now that would do me for now and then it depends what else I do like around here I don't know what roof all of this bit is going to have but I think as the backstage bit I think that's pretty cool that's basically what what I planned okay so for the more presentable area which is this front bit I wanted to use the uh, the asphalt now let me just narrow it down and see what my options are here yeah there's no curved bits which I find really sad <laughs> because I've got a curved thing here so that's not going to work I'll tell you what might though because there is I think there are some curved bits with tiles so let's have a look at them I may have to adapt my plan yeah hang on again I need to get the, sh the, the grid size done okay that's fine I can do these and these are no they're not oh I thought they were colorable isn't that red one that is colorable or do I like the color what's the red one I'm sure there's a red one isn't there that has um, yeah this one painted clay okay let's just let's just go to, to clay yeah, so painted clay here we go so we have a colorable roof and I was I was hoping to do more green but a different shade like that now whether I uh, ooh, how do I want to do that I think yeah I think that's what I want for the entrance and then have the have it connected like this oh hang on if I no that, yeah that is right yeah okay what does that look like yeah that's it's quite in your face isn't it but I, I kind of like that actually as an entrance yeah um, we've got the ridge here as well that needs to go on as a finishing touch Oh, the height's gone funky again, hasn't it? 
I don't like it when the height is is non-existent. I like it to snap a little bit. There we go. That's the right height. Like so. Cool. Yeah, I like that. I might come back and put in some sort of yeah, actually, I'll, I'll, I like that. I like the idea of it having a couple of windows like this. Yeah, I like that. Uh, now, do I want those windows? Let's just check this out. No, that's not the right angle. I need... No, I need a really steep bit. Oh, that's going to then stick... Yeah, that's what I was hoping I could do, but it sticks out, doesn't it? Actually, what I think you can do it with these if you if you get them in the right place. No, no. I wonder if, if I do the height, does that work? No, they don't connect up, do they? Oh, that's that's a shame. I mean, I can at least, I can still make it a, t a tiny bit longer by putting these on anyway. Okay, that looks good. Let's keep going with this then. So let's go with need a little bit of brick wall under here. Okay, hang on. Oh no, I suppose it'd be, yeah, it'd be like that, wouldn't it? Oh, that's not actually deep enough. Let's let's get it right first time. Like, oh, what's that doing? That's being funky. That's what that's doing. And I wonder if I do it like that. Is that going to work? Yeah, that's fine. There we go. And then we can get a little bit of triangle on top. Beautiful. Or oh, do I want an overhang though? Do you know what? I think I probably do. So I'm thinking if I can highlight these, I might just move them back one, one notch. So rather than being there, they're back in there. What? Yeah, see that looks a bit too in your face, I think, a bit too bold. I think actually if you move them back and have the overhang, I think that looks better. Now they're not sticking out anywhere, are they? No, good. Uh, so obviously at the moment you can see them from underneath, but I can put in a flat roof under here to hide that. Yeah, that looks much better, doesn't it? I like that. Excellent. I, I, I don't even mind that this is a sort of overhanging and not going anywhere either. Great. Okay, let's go back to this. And let's go back to, was it clay? Yes. So I'm going to need some trim. Like that. I think that always looks nicer getting the trim on. Is that the right trim? Yes, that does. I think that's right, yeah. Cool. Um, it's going to be tricky again because some of this... At the moment, it looks like it's all going to plan, but I guarantee you I'm going to have some issues. Uh, right, I don't need that bit on. Uh, because there's going to be bits like over the top of this cafe here where I'm going to have to try and hide some stuff um, but that's all right I'll I'll keep going it, it's it, it's gonna yeah it's it's gonna be a work that goes wrong and then I have to come back and make changes and corrections but that's fine I'm okay with that blimey my half hour is nearly up already doesn't feel like I've got much done unfortunately but you know that's how it goes sometimes 
I'm going to I'm not going to do any more detailing to all of this until I finish the main structure of the roof. Um, see the let's go with the glass. So this is I wanted to do the glass over the top of this Cayman area, but I hadn't really worked out which glass. I like this one as a as a basic shape. I really do like the look of that. Did I hang on yeah I've got I don't know how high I'm gonna make it yet, um but I, I kinda wanna yeah I want to get it in the right place uh, you see that's not in the right place I want to get it in the right place so it's square over the top of this area um, do I want to take this right to the end or do I want to bring it in not sure uh, and then I think what my line with here yeah line with this one like so uh, and then this piece like so so yeah so this is uh, I'll tell you what actually no what let's um, do you know what I'm gonna do no I'm not I was thinking I might separate these and have them as a separate grid but actually no let's let's bring that to there let's just get rid of that quickly and let's just copy this over So do I want one big roof or do I want it as sort of two of them or let's try and space it right. Yeah, I think that's the right spacing. But the question is, do I do another layer or do I make it square on the top there? Oh, what's happened there? Oh, I've, the, the entire thing is wonky. Okay, let's try that again. There we go. Okay. I'm not too sure about the height yet either, whether I'm going to have that raised or not. I don't think I am. That's probably, I think that is too tall. I think I do need to sink all of this down. Let's come over this way. I want it to line up with this um, this roof along here. Yeah, so if I do it like that, it matches this perfectly here. And then I've just got to work out what I'm doing at this end. Plus, what am I doing in the middle? What am I doing with my life? Who knows? <laughs> um, or do I leave it open? It's just a thought. Let the rain come in. Oh, there's so many options. Let's just try and do the the second layer and see what it looks like. I might like it, I might not. Oops. Okay, there we go. What does that look like? Actually, I like that. That's a lovely shape. Yeah, I do like that a lot. What's it look like from down here? Yeah, that's nice, isn't it? That's suitably greenhousey, which is what I was going for in this area. Uh, Steve, I think the Gardening for Health and Wellbeing, you did suggest um, whether I was going to be doing skylights. Uh, well, the answer clearly is no. Good idea though, good idea, but that it's not what I envisioned, envisaged from the start, I'm afraid. That was, uh, I really wanted this uh, to be one big glass roof all the way along here. So I'm gonna look at the support because clearly it's gonna need some beams coming down. I mean, it's supported here, which is good, and, and over here is fine, but there's nothing at all along this edge and this edge. So it will need some support along the way, which is another detail I need to add. 
and obviously I'm going to work out what I'm doing around this area. I'm going to have a roof that hangs out to give a bit of a cover out here as well. And then I've got this whole area here too. I kind of like the idea of this not being hidden. I don't really, I want you to be able to see that glass roof from over here. Yeah, like that. See that? It looks really nice. So I don't want to hide it. I love these two bits here and I really like this design here. I'll probably copy this design over to here. It will need to change a bit because the shape of the building is a bit different over here now. But I can I can hopefully sort of copy it and, and manipulate it. Um, and I think the rest of this, I think, I think so the two entrances, so, you, you, so you've got like different themed bits of roof, you see, for different things. So you've got the workman roof, which is the backstage, which is all this green stuff back here that you don't really get to see. The showy offy bit, the fancy expensive bit, which is the entrance uh, and then the entrance over that side. You've got the glass bit to create your tropical look in the middle here. And then the rest of it I want to do with the asphalt. Because the asphalt, it looks nice, but it's ch much cheaper than this clay tile would be. And it's it's much more functional. That's my thinking. Um, I'm just not entirely sure how that's going to look. Like I said, I don't want to hide this. So this is this is a tricky bit to, to, to do just here. Um, I can only think that I might do something like this potentially something like that so that it's not too hidden from over here I don't know if that's gonna look okay let's let's just chuck some more of that along and see what we think I kind of like it as a, a basic premise for a roof along the front there. Yeah, actually, I do think I think that looks quite good because you know you still see the the glass behind it, but it's also going to hide potentially. What I may even do with a lot of this here is make it completely flat, because you don't see it, so it only needs to be functional. See, so this, if I if I continue this around the corner here. And then the same along here. I continue it around the corner and then along here. It will hide anything that I put behind it. So the rest of that can just be flat and you won't see any of it at all. And it makes a nice bit of cover out the front here. And I'll have to play around here because you've got the top of the wall here. So this will need to be raised up to meet it. And then obviously I can do some beams and things out the front. Um, make sure I get all the corner looking good. Uh, from in here, it looks fine. Once the wall is extended upwards, you've then you've got this edge here, which I just need somehow to to support. Or that, you know, actually, I can probably get away. Once the wall is up there, I can probably get away with not having supports there. Um, I don't think it would need it, and and I, I might be able to do something similar here with flat pieces as well so it makes it look like it's supported even though it's sort of not yeah that could work but I am going to call the episode to an end there um, because um, I've been waffling on for long enough but we're making really good progress look at that it, it's starting to look like a building which is pretty crazy isn't it still an awful long way to go but we are definitely making some good progress there and I'm, I'm really happy with how this roof is coming along so far not finished but we are definitely heading in the right direction aren't we yeah good let me know what you think do you like my roofs um chances are i'm afraid again your your feedback won't reach me until i finish this because um i'm working a few days in advance but uh, there's not a lot i can do about that but uh, please do still leave your your feedback um as you've seen i will go back and make changes and implement things if you come up with good ideas so uh, yeah keep the ideas coming uh, and once more, just thank you very much for all your support. I really do appreciate you uh, watching my videos and, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying our little community that we've got going here. Um, yeah, brings me a lot of joy. So thank you very much. Right. I'm going to leave it there. So if you've liked the episode, please hit the like button. That'd be fantastic. And uh, hopefully you can join me again 
in the next episode. Until then, do take care of yourselves and I'll see you soon.